Welcome back to another episode of the Brother Saga Podcast. I am Mike Shrews, and this side of me today is my brother. Would you introduce yourself? Fuck. Her. <laughs> what was that? The Kenny. Oh, all right. I'm going to turn you up some. Speak again. Hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. All right, everybody. Welcome back to another episode. And today, I'm not sure what we're doing. Last week, we missed out because I just was not feeling up to it. Honestly, today, I just wasn't feeling up to it. But I was like, no, nah, Kenny's staying up. So I'll, I'll get up and do something. <laughs> um, so I guess the basis of the show, like always... It's just us talking and catching up. Um, so, what have you been up to, man? Since we missed for a week or two. Finally got walls. You finally got walls, yes. We see that in your background. You finally got walls. You're a little echoey, though, now because of those walls. Oh, yeah. Um, but that'll fix once you start getting stuff filled in there and stuff. Are you building your own bed frame? Is that what that is? It's done. We just got to put the bed on it. But you built it by yourself, right? It's one of those pre-made things. Oh, okay. That's still cool. <laughs> it came in boxes of it with a painting on the Ah, <clears throat> gotcha. And then <clears throat> two matching tables with it. Yeah, yeah. That's cool, man. It'll look cool. It'll look cool. You can, uh, what you should do is you should have set up like something for like your desk area right behind you. So you can just drop like a screen or some bullshit down. Like a green blanket yeah. or something. <laughs> yeah. Well, right now I'm pretty much running off of whatever I can put my computer on. Yeah. My desk area is not ready yet. Oh. Because I'll be done until paint is 100% done. Right. Well, I mean, it is what it is. You're, you're still working too, so it's going to take some time to get through it. Um,. You've been up to anything else besides that? Well, not working for a week. <laughs> <laughs> Again. Again. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because you, uh, I guess you could do that as a story time from when we do story time, but yeah. Um, Off of work until I go back Sunday, so. Yeah. Have you watched anything uh, recently? Any new shit? Mm. What did we watch the other day? Oh, I finally watched Sonic. <laughs> you mean, fi you finally watched it? I thought you had seen it already. No. Uh, no? We ended up just like writing it on Amazon. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. Man, I want to watch it again. I'll probably end up buying it just because I was entertained by it. It's a nice, nice fun movie for uh, families and shit. It's, uh... Yeah, it's it's made for the people who played the game growing up who have kids now. <laughs> um, that's that's how I've always looked at it, man. Uh, but yeah, um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Like, uh, for me, we uh, well, we were just watching the Big Show show. Um, we finished it too. You what? We finished that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We no, just I forgot about that. we just started the sec we just watched the second episode, so like we we haven't really like dove into it or anything. We did watch um, WWE put out like some weird like kid movie um, based around NXT more so, and uh, it was all right. It was a family movie, you know. Um, the Big Show show. No, I'm uh, I'm interested to see what they're. What they do with that 
it's it's pretty much it just shoved him into what they were doing just right a family show right except for it's the big show like um, himself yeah yeah i think so it's, it's just like any of those you know like yeah uh, um family and shows So, I'm I'm trying to see if I'm synced because I don't think I'm synced. Uh, Yeah, I'm not I'm not synced again this week again with the whole not syncing, and I know why. Um, well, I don't know why. I don't understand why it keeps doing that. But I am going. But you know how to fix it. To boom to this camera here, and I'm synced up with this camera, and then I can go back and boom, I'm synced up with this camera now again. What the hell? Okay, anyways, <laughs> <laughs> um, anyways, guys, so Any yeah, this one's <laughs> this camera's not syncing me up today. What is going on? Is the extra crap open? Is it because of this is being open? There we go. Uh, issues, issues, issues. There's always something um, issuey with this uh, with this um, issue. <laughs> okay. Did this work? I hope so. I can't tell. It looks like it. Uh, yeah. Okay. At, at least my movements for me are the same movements. Oh, oh nope! Now they're they're ghosting on me again, motherfucker! People need so, someone needs to fix that issue in this camera. Um, so we're just gonna go back to this camera here, <laughs> and we'll do it off of this crappy ass camera today. Uh, and you get this nice glowing effect over here. Sorry guys for the appearance. Um. Yeah. That sucks. It always does that for to me for some reason. It always just screws with me. And I'm getting annoyed with it. Very annoyed with it. Um But yeah, uh the big show shows it's it's alright. It's like a full house kind of Disney channel y movie type thing. Did you um there's another one that we watched. It was uh Outmatched. I don't know if we talked if we've talked about that one before. No, I, I don't think I've heard of that one. What was it's that? A, it's got the uh it's got uh the Jason Biggs from Maker Pie in it. Oh no, I no. No. And uh Alicia Stillerstone. And I guess they got like their kids are all the like, geniuses. Mm. It's funny. All right, so yeah. one more time. Try your camera again. Just one more time. We'll take me out. <laughs> How you going? And put me back in. I'm here. Sort of. I don't know. We'll see how well it works. So, what up? There's another brother. There's another brother. Hey! What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> he wants to go home, but no, it took too long. How are you? Oh, that's very loud. He's gonna slam it. <laughs> I knew that. I knew it. That was that was our uh, our baby brother Connor. So everyone knows every time he uh, he just walks in randomly. <laughs> I should have locked the door. It's a new door and everything. <laughs> oh, man. The door because when I was... You had to move the door frame. Yeah. It, just, it kind of fell apart. And then I got mad because it fell apart and broke the door. <laughs> <laughs> Forget it. Yeah. So, what are we doing today, bro? What are we doing? What are we doing? We got story time. Do you want to get into story time now? Or do you want to keep talking about other shit? 
You can start story time. You want to start story time. Oh, shit. Do you got a story? Me? Yes, you. Really one that lasts right along. What's that? Well, uh, hold the on. The reason hold. I'm out of work. Okay, go into story time and the reason you're out of work. Oh. See, last Wednesday, mm-hmm. I went to grab myself a couple of pops, got ready to go out the door. Hard time breathing. Right. Uh, take my inhaler, still didn't really help much. Ended up almost collapsing in the living room, got caught. Pretty much, so I didn't fall on the floor. Yeah. Did, um... Called 911, the fire truck coming down the street and all that stuff. Right. It's not like they have to go that far. You're, like, right down the (laughs) street from them. But they came down and checked me out, and by the time they came and checked me out, they were like, everything seems fine. Yeah. Because I sat down and relaxed a little bit. Yeah, that was that was something fun. Ended yeah. up in the emergency room. How'd Still that go? Asthma attack, I guess. Was that is that where you or why you were out of work for the whole week? Yeah, because um, if you have any kind of symptoms, you're pretty much like out of work for ten days now. Gotcha. But uh, I actually had. The state of Ohio called me, asking me, if, tell me, if, well, you were put down as a probable COVID. I was like, no, I had an asthma attack. <laughs> oh. Like, even the doctor was like, yeah, I'm not going to test you. It was probably just that, not a big deal. They're just trying to get their numbers up. <laughs> they, they pushed me in and out of the ER in maybe like 15 minutes. I'm getting sick. Yeah. All right. So what's going on here? Now it's not even reading my other fucking camera, and it's very annoying. Back for another round. Hey, just because you want the bird, you don't want to miss a cooler, man. You bust your dragon. No. What's he say? He what? Oh, me? I, yeah, I, was, I unplugged my camera and plugged it back in to see if it will work. It looks like it's not lagging right now. And we'll see. <laughs> Boom. There he goes again. All right, so that's a sucky story, bro. That Not 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 a sucky story. It's a sucky the cause, <laughs> I should say. I'm going to die in my living room? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, man. Um... <clears throat> Yeah, I can't top that one. Wait, do I have a death story? An almost death story? I promised I promised everyone last episode I wouldn't give another gun story. So <laughs> we're not going to do that today. Um, oh, geez, I, I didn't even think of a story for this week. Uh, I, honestly, I didn't even have one ready for last week. If we would have gone live, I would have been like, uh, yeah. Um. Shit, now I can't even think of any any fun things in my life. Uh, there's just so much crappy shit going on in the world right now. I don't want to think of the the fun stuff. <laughs> oh man, um, I will say, how about this, motherfucker? This camera is a piece of shit today. All right, we're just gonna go with this. I, I might just be using way too much power from the computer right now because i think i still am outputting some stuff uh, some video projects i was working on all right so um we'll go with some backyard wrestling shit there we go uh back in the day um and i actually have some pictures um i'll have to bring them up one of these one of these episodes once i get everybody in the photos permission to uh to show them um because i have one of you and connor when you were just little like kids and shit like that uh when we had our own uh wrestling company um and i actually have when i was up there 
uh, a few years back, um, we still had the main championship wrestling belt that we had made out of like a piece of fucking, uh, like crappy wood, like, uh, like paneling wood. Um, and, uh, that was loud. What the hell was that? Somebody moving something upstairs. Yeah. But, um, yeah, it was, uh, it was a piece of wood that we just, like, cut into, like, a triangular kind of format to look cool. And we spray painted it gold. And then, um, our older brother, Travis, um, he did some, like, calligraphy shit to write the name of the company on it. I actually have that, the piece, anyways. The belt was just, we used normal belts and taped them to the fucking belts and stuff. I don't remember, know if you remember any of that. Um, yeah. But I have some pictures of you guys, you and Connor, when you were little, just like dressed up in some like fake wrestling uh, attire um, as kids and shit, and uh, uh, surrounded by the belts up and uh, hanging around and shit. Because we had like belts for everything. And then I had um, an actual WWF um, championship belt, which was so faded like the you couldn't tell what it really was i mean you could tell enough but it was just so faded so i took the main plastic piece off of it and busted it up and made my own hardcore belt for our company out of an old wwf belt (laughs) which is basically how they kind of made their hardcore belt the original one anyway so um but we did the wrestling company thing uh, like a wrestling company quote unquote uh in our backyard and I remember doing a lot of crazy shit, and there's lots of stories in here too for other days. Um, but one of the ones I remember a lot because I think now that I'm getting older, I'm re feeling the ramifications of some of this shit. <laughs> um, was we were wrestling, and it was with my old our older brother Travis uh, in the backyard, and I always did the high diving stuff. Like, Jeff Hardy is the guy I looked up to as a pro wrestler, like, person, stuff like that. So, I always did everything he tried to do, you know. Um, And then, uh, uh, we were wrestling in the backyard, and and we I laid Travis out onto this wooden ladder that was on uh, being held up in the air off of i believe they were hay bales that we found like after like some harvest festival thing or or like some halloween decoration that people threw out in the road um which by the way people don't ever grab hay bales that have been sitting on the side of the road in the city they get infested with bugs really fast (laughs) and then you get these weird ass like yeah it's not good um anyways uh so I laid Travis out on the the this old rickety ladder that we still used too. Um, it was totally not safe to use. And I got up on the fence, which there there was another ladder, and I jumped off the fence over to grab onto the ladder like leapfrog, and do a a backflip at the same time like leapfrog and flip onto him who was laying on the ladder. Well, he was a little pussy <laughs> and moved. And I went straight onto the ladder with, and I didn't have a shirt on. I just had shorts on straight onto the ladder with no body cushion, no cushioning whatsoever between me and the wood and the, uh, the metal hinges. <laughs> Cause it was an old rickety metal, um, ladder yeah that uh that sucked but i i i still fin we still finished the match and i didn't bitch about it i never bitched about it but now that i'm getting older and i can try kind of feel like the ramifications of doing stupid shit like that now i get a chance to bitch about it <laughs> so that's my story time uh do you have any other stories since yours was shorter or no um, not really. No. All right. So then we can say goodbye to story time. Look at that. It's, it went bye bye. 
All right. Um. So we got about a good, I don't know, thirty minutes left, and we don't have a meat end to this podcast, really. Like a, a gritty the the beef, like we've been doing. Um, the last few episodes where we've gone to streaming sites just to make fun of this stuff, which is the basis of, not the basis of the podcast, but it's, it's why I decided to start the podcast because I found that to be fun and then we did it, but it kind of gets old after so long. We have to take some breaks in between guys. Um, so do you have any ideas as to what we can do for the meat end of this podcast today since we are live <laughs> uh, um, do not oh come on man don't leave me hanging like that <laughs> <laughs> all right so how about this um it's okay. hard i was thinking we could do like a like some free game or some shit but that it's not a really easy way to do it um, cause you can't play and we see what you're seeing, uh, unless you had, you shared your screen with me. Um, but then it becomes a whole more jumbled mess that I'd have to figure out, which I guess we could figure it out later down the road. Um, so is there anything that you can think of? Anything at all? Or do you want to call it a short cast? <laughs> <laughs> Best free games online. <clears throat> all right. All right. Nope. Nope. Oh. <laughs> nope. Nope. So there are a bunch of gaming sites out there. Like, like, uh, um, like stupid little, like, IO games and shit like that. Uh, let's see here. Scratch. M. Nope. Armorgames.com. So we're going to go, let's try this, um, and I'll share this with you or with everybody else so people can see too. Um, I think this should work here. So now everyone, you can see what I'm seeing, correct, Kenny? Yeah. This right here? All right. So let's see. Is there anything that we can find? These are jump scare games only. So... I don't know. Wait, is this trying to sell them to me? No. Free games online. Jump scare. Let's go back to free games online for this one. I don't know what the hell this site is, people. Um, so if they give me a virus, uh, fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> right? Uh, math ball? No. Portrait... Of an obsession of Forgotten Hills. That, no. Dream. There's also like categories and stuff. What's that? So there's categories at the top. Oh, there is. Okay. Shooting, action, adventure, puzzle, tower defense, idol, or all these. Zor. Zor. I was going to say Zor. It's fucking zombie. <laughs> Zor. Um, horror. P RPG, Sniper, War, Army. Uh, let's go horror. I, I mean, a good old jump scare is always fun, right? Right. Let's see. Midnight Cinema. What's that? Wait. Popular know. horror game. It's a popular horror game. It says popular, people. It says... It says popular. Oh. <laughs> oh. Flash is blocked. Um, my flash is not blocked, sir. My flash is not blocked. <laughs> well, now there's an ad running. Yeah, they're trying to get me to download their stuff. Let's go back. All right. Well, that would have been a cool one. Maybe. The strange oh. disappearance of... No. Over... Cursed? Yeah, some strange games on there. My flash is up to date too, so I don't know why it's trying to tell me it's not. 
skip ad. We don't do no ads here. Come on. There we go. Honestly, I really shouldn't. Okay. Feather with headphones. All right, so. Hold on. Can you guys, hear anybody hear that or no? I am not hearing anything. It's something. It's faint. Left click to move. Take, uh, okay, so. This should be interesting. Because <laughs> this is something I've never done before. Honestly. What is that? What's Over that? Cursed. Right click to throw object. To move. Okay. Is the volume up on the game? Um. I gotta make sure the volume is going out the proper way. I messed up. Now your stuff's on the screen. Oops. Ooh. Okay, it says it's output into the headphone jack. Technical difficulties, maybe? Start and see what happens. <laughs> It's not coming through. So let's go over here. Hmm. Or maybe there's just no audio coming in at the moment, huh? Wait. Did that come through? Yeah, I heard a click. Okay, here we go. Cool. <clears throat> All right. You, you overcursed ink. What can I do for you? All right, what do we want them to do? Um, what does it even do? Customer, finally, what kept you? There is some electromagnetic disturbance. Please do something. It's probably an evil spirit. Don't worry. I'll take care of it. All right, let's see what we're going to do. And I'll get your input too. To see what we do. All right. So where do we go? Where do you? What do you think? Let's see. Find the. Find the disturbance. I'm a cheap people, and I'm gonna use a real mouse today. Is it? Is it? On the, there we go. It's connected. All right. So. Find the disturbance. How the hell you can barely see the screen? What's that? So I can barely see it just because it's so dark. Yeah, let's see. If I brighten it up, does it brighten it up on your end or no? Yeah, you're good. Let's okay. see. Is even... That's weird. Ooh, they're in the house. Okay. Should we just go up to the bedroom already? Hmm. Find the cause of the electromagnetic disturbance. My guess is that it would be up high, right? I mean, that makes sense. I don't know. The lamp is moving below you. Is it? There's a TV antenna right here. Go back to the car. So I, I guess we fixed it? The the thing was the issue? The antenna was the issue? Uh, or, is that what is that what it is? The TV's working. Was that? So now the TV's Oh working. shit. Find find Rocky. Rocky's the dog, right? He went this way, right? Yeah. He's right here. Go back to the car with Rocky. Oh, 
We're lagging. We're lagging. There we go. Okay. Now, how do I... Do I pick him up? Okay, I think. Come on, Rocky. Yeah, I think you gotta click Rocky. It's not working. Please. Yeah. Right oh. click. What? Right click, maybe. Nope, that's up. Hmm. Everything's pretty much left click, so I don't know what the hell we did. Wait, maybe if I grab the bone? Haha. -ha. He'll come and follow you with the bone. That's what it is. I hope. Yep. Sweet. I'm so yep. smart. <laughs> Look here. You can find the bone. Go back to the car. Oh, shit. You. You overcursed ink, I'm at your home. Thank God, here is the here's the charlatan. I beg your pardon. I don't believe in your tall tales. Can you read that? Kinda. Then you read it. <laughs> I don't want to. But my wife is so Superstitious, he says. The customer says, "Install your stupid detectors and go away." This would be a horrible just audio podcast, just so we're clear. Oh, yeah. <laughs> customer click. Paranormal detection. Plug the detector to the wall outlet. So there's a wall. No, that's a switch. So we can, here's a wall outlet, right? What the hell? You have to grab the detector. You have to put each. So confused. I don't know where's the plug going. <laughs> there we go. Oh. You drop it. <laughs> yeah, I'd like to. All right. So if I go here, and then the fuck. Oh, wait. Is that how I drop it? Go down to the end where the plug is. What the hell? Now you got it again. <laughs> That's so weird. I'm I'm so confused. Is any if anyone can help, can you figure this out? Please help me figure this out. What's that? Behind you. That goes in the outlet. Well, there's only one outlet on each floor, I'm assuming. I'm just going through to make sure. Yeah, so there's only one outlet on this level of the house. Another one's right above you. So, here. plug the detectors to the wall outlets. Zero of three. So you have to grab a detector. No. Grab the detector. Uh, the other end of that. See, plug. Okay. Oh, you plug it now. There we go. <laughs> All right. Now we got something coming up. <laughs> the thing is weird is that the plug was just going wherever it wanted to go. <laughs> right? The plug's just like searching around. All right, the so one. there's one right there and there's one right here. Put that down. 
Oh, the door is locked. Haha. I see you. Okay. So let's grab the detector and go upstairs with it. Which means we gotta find the key to get into that locked room. Mother crapper. Did it work? Oh, there's the key. Look at that. <laughs> so easy. <laughs> this game is so simple. I, I guess. I mean, if you can figure that, what you're supposed to do. <laughs> you can just find the plug on the detector. Okay. Where are you going, bro? Come open the locked door. Duh. No more locked doors. <laughs> FYI, um, 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 the Brother Saga podcast does not promote The Mandalorian from Star Wars, Disney Plus, or any other Disney affiliates, even though the ad is on our screen right now. I just have to say that. <laughs> Get rid of the ad. Oh, I guess I could. I could click it. But then God knows what other ad's going to pop up. See? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, fresh. <laughs> alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Alright, I wonder how long this game actually is. I figure, I thought it was like a short game or something. Man, it takes a minute for this to work. I mean, it doesn't help I have like 500 or things open on the computer right now, so... Okay. So then we'll grab this and put it in. <laughs> put it in the plug. The outlet. Uh oh. This is off. You broke it. Turn the electricity back. Oh no. Lights don't work. Now you gotta find the light. Alright, so there has to be a power switch then. I'm I'm somewhere. I'm guessing. Fuck this music also. <laughs> what? <laughs> Fuck this music. I can't even hear it. No? No. Can you hear it now? I can a little bit. Alright. Circuit breaker, there we go. Go back to the car. What? I mean, if I'm going back to the car, what did I need to turn the power on for? <laughs> if I'm dipping, right? I mean... Oi. Come on, doggy. Or am I leaving the dog here, I guess. I, I guess we're just leaving the dog here. <laughs> now the dog's back. What can I do for you? A, a beast lives in my house. Please kill this awful thing. Seems like a bad jump scare game. <laughs> Find a way to remove the bad smells. Consider it done. The fuck? What the fuck? Remove the bad smells and what? But how? It's like a five-year-old design this game. I mean, it's a free game. Shh. 
Uh, how do I know what a smell looks like? <laughs> right. <laughs> Remove the bad smells and kill the beast. What's on the floor? Okay. Oh, I see. There's a bad smell right there. Deodorant. Are you kidding me? Like that? Is that how you kill the bad smell? I don't know. It might, it might. Yes, you got one. Let's see. Okay, cool, cool, cool. <laughs> That's so weird. There's uh, another one, I think. Oh. Oh, there it oh, is. Oh, there it is. Maybe it's just your so, dog. So you have to walk past it? I guess. To to um, see it, apparently. Interesting. I think it's just coming out of your dog. <laughs> <laughs> Smelly dog. Um, I guess, I guess that's how they make it, so you have to walk the whole house. Is it this dog barking? Uh, that yeah, is the that fucking dog, he's spitting it out. It is the dog, I told you. <laughs> little, little sh shithead. The dog just shut his mouth. Can't I just turn these switches on? I mean, wouldn't that light up shit? <laughs> That'd be dark. That, that works. <laughs> I did turn on the light. Oh, that fucking dog. Oh, I guess the dog is smelling the sniffing the smells out for you is what it is. Ooh, there you gotta find the beast. Alright, now I mean we walked the whole house, right? You know the stairway going up or I don't know. I done lost it. No, there's nothing up there. Hiding in the basement. Oh no. <laughs> um, is he over here? Past all that stuff. Is he gonna pop out at me? Is that what's gonna fucking happen? Is that what's supposed to happen? Is the, the the thing pops out of that shit? It's gonna be some like big old. If it fucking makes me jump, I'm gonna be pissed. <laughs> uh oh. The dog. I hear the dog barking at something. Where is it? Can I get in the car to kill the beast? Is the beast in the house? Is Did they clarify if the beast was in the house? I thought so. Mother fucker. It's on the floor right there. That was something we had brought in. Oh, it's a bear trap. Okay. There, now you're ready for the beast. Okay. That would have been nice to know. It's like, we're not going to give you the beast until you're ready for him. Okay, so... This is clearly is not right here. Or is the dog going to sniff the beast out and it's just going to magically appear out of his ass? <laughs> is that what's going to happen no, here? I think the dog was just farting. Uh, I hear something. Don't you hear something? A beast or something? Come on, there's gotta be somewhere in this damn house. I swear, this is the last level. <laughs> Just so people are aware, this is the last level we're doing anyways. Because we're almost at our hour time anyway. What the hell? I'm not seeing no beast, bro. Look that line, do ya? Hmm. Bear trap your own dog. <laughs> I wonder if I put a 
the bear trap. I mean, you have to see the beast, right? To, to be able to put the bear trap where you know it, it'll walk. I'm assuming. Or maybe turn on some of these lights? Maybe. Beast is gone. Turn this light on. Maybe put the the trap right here. I think you can't have it. Huh. I love how we're still carrying the bone around so the damn dog doesn't just like dip on us. <laughs> <laughs> it's now to a stick. What's that? Now it's tied to a stick for you. Yeah. Okay, so I hear something. There's something chewing somewhere. So we've got to be able to sit this bear trap down. Is it outside? Is it? Have you the car, maybe? Let's see. I mean, that would make sense if it's a bear trap. Nope. This is... That's as far as we can go. It is stupid. Okay. Kill the beast. Just show me the beast. Can't kill it if it's not there. Hmm. This is interesting and annoying at the same time. On the yeah. I guess go upstairs and see if there's other lights out. Can it's I? A closet or something. I can't put the bear trap down. And I, fi I would think the food pantry would be where you would want to put the trap, right? I guess we get to try and go upstairs again. <laughs> See, I hear it, it, it chewing. When I, whenever I go right here, I hear chewing. If I pick the other the other end back up again. Oh now you oh now you drop the bear trap. Okay, so you need to have the bear trap in hand just to kill it, apparently. Because apparently holding a bear trap is gonna kill something. What? I don't think they know how bear traps work. This is fu this is freaking annoying. R remind me not to do this one again. Is it not just gonna jump out at me or what? Is there a light switch for that room or no? No, this is like a little hallway thing. But there is a light switch up here. I'm not sure if we turn that on or not. Yeah. Maybe I'll keep it dark and the beast will come out in the dark. I think. Okay, I'm lost. So much for being an easy game. <laughs> Alright. So, like, finally, you gotta kill the beast, but there's no beast. Okay. Okay, I think I'm done. Are you good? Do you, do you have any other recommendations on where I could find this beast? No. 
Every time I come down to the bottom of these stairs... Look, listen. I'll turn it up as loud. I'm pretty sure they just forgot to put the beast in that level. <laughs> <laughs> that would be fucked up. That would be so fucked up. Okay. Okay. That would be fucked up if that's what they did. If they just forgot to put the beast in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. All right. So, well, that was Armor Games, I believe it was called. Um, yeah, they... So... so okay. What is going on up there? I don't know. I hear people. Oh. Did Connor take off then? No. No? What? He actually oh. rode with me back over here, so. Ah. I got to take him home. <laughs> gotcha. His lazy ass could have joined us too, man. Lazy bum. Right. All right. All right. I don't play echoey, though. What's that? That would have been really echoey then. Oh, yeah, yeah. He was just talking out and yeah. Yeah, well, that game was such... I'm so mad at that game. <laughs> 10 to 1, when we go off the stream, I'll probably turn it back on to try and figure out where the hell the the, the beast is. Uh, That's so, terrible. Yes, I know it is. I know this. Um, next week we definitely need to find something else, unless we want to do another like actual game game. Um, right. I'm not sure how well my bandwidth could handle doing everything all at once, but we could try something. Um, and then uh, come up with something else. If people have suggestions of uh, of meaty topics or meaty elements to do i'm just looking for something fun to do with my brother that's it um so if people have anything just let us know i i i, I looked up like 30 something thing different things to do during live stream and like most of them are just like sell your product or talk about your career or, or <laughs> all these things i'm like what that's not entertaining at all that's <laughs> boring I mean, I'm like, I'm more entertained when I, when I pull up dumb movie titles and watch my brother just go like, what the fuck? <laughs> oh. Definitely gotta get my that? desk set up because this is crazy. Oh, you're good. You're good. <laughs> and my computer's all dusty. Boom. Well, I think it's about that time. We're we're at about an hour now. I think that's where we were trying to stay, right? Shit. I'm too tired for this right now. <laughs> Over here. Mm. This way we are. Uh, and you got the drive still. So. <laughs> right. No, actually you don't have to drive that far. All right. Um, trying to get my night-night juice ready. <laughs> uh, all right well i appreciate you hanging out with me for another fun hour of 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 nothingness again <laughs> right we'll get it down pat i know um with everything going on right now we're both been pretty busy so <sighs> we'll see what we can get going make some 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 improvements and some uh better things i might um get rid of the background behind us that that uh is constantly moving because i feel that might be help like slowing stuff down um what's that got to be (laughs) right it's got to do something and then like come on this camera needs to start working this camera 
just needs to work. It is working right now, isn't it? Awesome. Cool. Perfect. At the end of the cast. Right? Right. Yeah, cool. Um, got any recommendations for people, bro? Since we're here? One recommendation? Two recommendations? Five recommendations? <laughs> <laughs> recommendations as in... Um, movies, shows games anything anything you think people should be doing with their spare time right now because i mean there's a lot of people still in quarantine um well um it's more of an adult show but there's one called the uh the great okay i think it's uh it's about um the russian um monarchs and stuff like that Okay. It's pretty funny. Yeah. Don't let your kids in the room while you watch it. <laughs> but that, that is a funny show. Yeah. Well, yeah. Uh, is it is it meant to be like a, an adult comedy? Is that what it is? Yeah. Yeah. I know um that Space Force show just dropped on Netflix. I haven't watched any of it yet, though, with yes, uh, Steve just Carell. Just like put on Facebook that they're watching it right now. Yeah. Yeah. So that's, that's one I'm going to try. I haven't heard a lot of good things about it, but we'll see. Um, I mean, if it fails, it's just like, you know, showing the future. (laughs) (laughs) Um, other than that, I mean, there's Waco. I watched Waco on Netflix and I recommend that I recommended it on operation Babel. Um, the last episode I just recorded that hasn't aired yet. I don't know if I recommend it on the episode that just came out this week. Uh, but Waco. So good. So good. It's a six part mini series on Netflix right now. It's not a Netflix original. It was aired somewhere else in like, oh, in like, I was going to say, oh, 18 in 18, 2018. <laughs> um, and it's about the, uh, Waco siege, Back in 93 uh, with the Davidians and all that stuff. So I recommend it. It does a really good job of um, showing kind of both sides of it. And then also uh, it doesn't do a bad job of like showing respect to all the people that had died. You know how sometimes if you're doing those true, true, true life events and shit like that. Right. It, it can be kind of like dis, not not uh, t- uh, tasteful or distasteful. Sorry, um, it can be distasteful sometimes when you're dealing with like slaughters of people and stuff like that, or or anything like you know. Um, so they did a really good job with it, and the acting is on point. And Melissa Benoist, who plays Supergirl, is in this, and it's the best I've ever seen her act. And it made me feel like crap for watching Supergirl. Because <laughs> that's the only other thing I've ever seen her in. is Supergirl and Jane Silent Bob Reboot. So then seeing Waco, I was like, oh damn, she can actually really act. Holy crap. Uh, that's terrible. So I recommend it. It also has... um, um, Oh, Kish. I forget his first name. Uh, he's the guy who played Gambit in X-Men Origins. And he played John Carter in John Carter. Uh, what are you talking about? But I don't remember yeah, that either. he plays the main um, lead character basically in the movie. Uh, and then you have Michael Shannon is in the movie, who for a lot of people was Eminem's mom's beefy boyfriend in Eight Mile, or he played Zod. And I'm just saying the two characters that like a general audience are gonna recognize him from. <laughs> Um, and that's all I got. Go watch Waco. Go watch Waco, everybody. And with that said, Kenny, thank you again for showing up. And like we do every week now, are you taking a shot tonight since you're doing other shit or no? Uh, nah. Well, I'm going to take a shot then for the both of us, but I'm only one shot because I'm running low. (laughs) For our brother, Robert. 
Robbie. There we go. Oh wait, and, and 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 we take this shot because he can't be here for us, and all of our other brothers can fuck off <laughs> because they can still be here. <laughs> there we go. Oh, with that, good night. Pieces from me, Kenny. Peace.